Local news about local people. This is Newslink Indiana. Good morning, I'm Chris Bavender. Thanks for joining us. Still looking for the perfect pumpkin? Newslink Indiana's Alyssa Rossame found a spot that brings in busloads in search of a fall favorite. Thank you. A patch of pint-sized pumpkin pickers. They get to go out and run around and pick out their pumpkins. Howell Farms harvest pumpkins of all shapes and sizes. After nearly 25 years of growing, they know what makes a good gourd. You want to look for a pumpkin that's, that's consistent in color, nice, solid. You want to feel it, make sure it's nice and solid and hard. This year, Howell Farms grew three acres of pumpkins, but the kids seem to agree on what makes a good one. A big one. A big one. A big one. When kids come, they get a farming lesson, a hayride, an apple, and perhaps their favorite part, the pumpkins. I found a biggest pumpkin I can ever carry. What are you going to do with your pumpkin? Um, take some stuff out of it. They all seem excited. I think I probably like it as much as they do. Kids at heart can take home pumpkins for 25 cents a pound. In Delaware County, Alyssa Rossame, Newslink, Indiana. Hal Farms is located near Middletown on County Road 600 West, just south of State Road 67. It's National Collegiate Alcohol Awareness Week and events kicked off Wednesday at Ball State University. The Health Education Department sponsored an interactive and educational booth to inform students about alcohol use and abuse. Brochures were available with information on the effects of alcohol, and students had a chance to wear fatal vision goggles, which simulate different levels of intoxication. This has been a particularly rough semester so far nationwide with student deaths from alcohol-related causes. Um, so there's some heightened sensitivity to it this year, but it is something that we do every year. Ball State is the only area school to participate in the event, which runs through Friday. Now here's Nicholas Ferrari with a look at our forecast. Nicholas? Thanks, Chris. Good morning, everybody. This morning, expect mostly cloudy skies with the temperature in the lower 50s and winds light from the northeast. Precision cast shows the clouds that have been lingering around the past couple of days clearing out by this afternoon when we will see a few peaks of sunshine. Look for a high today of 67 degrees and winds from the north northeast at 8 miles per hour. Then for tomorrow, look for a high of 70 degrees, a chance for rain and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Saturday, also a high of 70 degrees and that chance for rain. Chris, back to you. Thanks, Nicholas. That is Newslink Indiana. Join us at 627 tonight for more news and get local news about local people 24 hours a day at newslinkindiana.com.